So this is cool. Nice to get to know the neighbors. I said hello to one guy in the hall, but he was, like, really old. There's an old woman as well. Have you seen her? Hmm. Got to get off the neighborhood watch. So, uh, tell me, Elena, what do you, like, do? I'm working part-time as a legal secretary. Human rights law, asylum seekers, torture victims, all that jazz. But my real passion is music. Oh, that is so great. Oh, God, she's perfect. A musician who devotes her life to helping losers. I'm, like, grade 8 violin and a bit of piano. That's just so cool, cos, um... I'm a musician, too. What's your main instrument? Shit. I dabble, you know. I toot, I strum, I bongo. Oh, I love drums. Play me something. Uh, that's, that's not a bongo. That's just a small table in the shape of a bongo. Oh, so when you're not bongoing, do you, like, work? Danger. Uh, I was a male nurse for a while. Why did you stop? Disgust at having to help people in need. The white coats couldn't handle my whole... Patch Adams' approach. I believe a person should be treated as a human being, not a mere set of steel pipes. Oh, come on, I've got to think of something impressive. What the hell have I been doing all these years? Could be a dad she'd like to fuck. Only thing I've got in the locker. And, of course, uh, the big news is actually that I'm, uh, I'm going to be having a kid. Uh, are you in a relationship? Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no, a million times no. No, she's a friend, and she was desperate, and so I was all like, yeah. I'm a very strong feminist, so I believe women should have whatever mad thing they want. That's so cute, because I often think that children are our future. Yeah. And also, I'm just really into the whole man-baby thing, you know, teaching them to tie things to other things and, you know, holding a baby in the palm of my hand whilst making an espresso, you know? Yeah, Russian men are all probably infertile, thanks, Chernobyl. <laughs> oh, look, he's hit it. Do you think it'll go in the hole? <laughs> yeah, novelty golf date beats ironic sci-fi fun, Gerard. Hard cheese. And we've already had four whiskies, so time for me to roll in my militarised divisions. Makes it much less scary if I think about it like a war. Mark, are you about to launch? Is this pre-launch? Sorry, sh should I have filled out a lunging application form and had it ratified by the FSA? <laughs> Look, don't get me wrong, I like you, but maybe let's not do anything tonight. And when the dust settled with Gerard and my other dates, we'll see. Uh, OK, that, that's fine. Oh, my God, she likes me. She just said it. That's undeniable. I can bank that. I can put it on a blog so it's a matter of public record. Oh, my God, this guy doesn't know a nine-iron from a pitching wedge. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, we're Roosevelt and Stalin, Gerard's Churchill. He thinks he's in there, but when the fucking starts and Europe gets carved up, Churchill has to leave. Oh, shit. No, Soph, cancel. I'm cancelling you out of shame. Like my subscription to White Dwarf. Just the bank. The sperm bank, where I bank my stupid... <laughs> some lunch. Jeremy, there's some children here who want to have lunch with you. Really? Yeah, it's like I've got a river of pain running through me from here right the way down. <laughs>